Hey, it's Job Drops here, where you get news and views on jobs teachers don't tell you about. And as you've known, it's been COVID lockdown for about one and a half years now. And this has brought a new opportunities for those who can take advantage of it in the entrepreneurship field. New businesses, new ventures, especially with the amount of tech we have available. But most times, entrepreneurs have problems in getting the funding. So Dubai has aim to solve that problem at least for their country. Ahmad bin Mohammed launches a new digital crowdfunding platform for entrepreneurs. Let's see what they have to say. From Gulf News, His Highness Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, Vice President and Prime Minister of UAE and ruler of Dubai has continued to emphasize the role of youth in building the future and the importance of empowering them through providing them with opportunities that enable them to reach their full potential. He further going to see the interesting solutions and initiatives that will help transform the creative energies and supporting the development journey. So as you know, a lot of young persons are, might not be able to get jobs because a lot of those jobs are either being outsourced or they're just not available in their country due to the lockdowns. So this crowdfunding effort is to help those young entrepreneurs who have revolutionary ideas that can help restart the country. The Dubai Next platform will contribute to stimulating positive competition and encouraging you to put forward ideas as well as obtain community support through crowdfunding. It will also empower a generation that is capable of succeeding in a competitive commercial environment, thus reinforcing the fundamental role of SMEs in economic development so that the UAE can continue to stand as a model for youth and empowerment said Sheikh Hamdan. This crowdfunding is the use of small amounts of capital from individuals to finance a new business venture. Of course, this is with new te digital technologies. Entrepreneurs can now present their ideas to a large segment of the community, both locally and globally, and get the funding and financing that they need in order to start the idea. And as you know, this is similar to the GoFundMe campaigns where you can essentially put out that you have a game, have a product or a certain product or service that you wish to offer, but you need initial capital in order to get it off the ground. Probably even have a demo of the product already sometimes, and you just need the funding in order to like host the servers or be able to get the product out there into the market. So this is one way in which Dubai is tackling that initiative. And says so that Dubai continues to promote entrepreneurship, embrace innovators and entrepreneurs, and provide them with all forms of support, as per the directives of H. H. Sheikh Hamadan bin Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum. Additionally, Dubai has enabled entrepreneurs to implement their vision and transform their ideas into distinct projects that support sustainable development and efforts to build a knowledge economy. The city's ongoing efforts will contribute to enhancing the Emirates position locally and regionally and enable it to reach the largest segment of youth entrepreneurs in diverse sectors. According to the Director of General of Dubai Economy, Sami Al Karbsi. As you know, there are various different issues that are even going on currently right now with the COVID. A lot of persons from college probably have ideas that could indeed help them. It says the platform provides a good choice for students to present their projects to potential investors and supporters. It helps emerging enterprises to grow, expand, and launch new products. So it can even be a small business who just reach to expand, and you can get, be able to use this platform to help get additional funding in order to help expand into different fields. And so that Dubai Next. Packages include incubating the idea of in the Hamandan Innovative Incubator or the HI2 or in one of 14 certified incubators in Dubai. And some of these incubators or ventures that help to train some of these entrepreneurs to get their business ideas out, they include Wad <coughs> the Wadi Maka Venture. And this has um, been able to Point various startups include within the Hajj and the Kumra high tech and creative industries, 
Hajj meaning around the area where they would have Mecca, I believe. As well as as well as MISC 500 Accelerator Program, which just ended May 2020 last year. It should have happened earlier this year as well, but the pandemic has sort of pushed back out of the issues. And, being, and now they have to wait for a while before they can start this accelerator program. So for those of you who may be in, in that region or need to get an idea of the ground but maybe conscious not offer it, you can probably go to Dubai and see if they can help you with that. Also MISC 500 is one of those accelerators that has helped different companies including 16 and was organized by the same Prince Mohammed bin Salam bin Abdullah Zizi Foundation. Sorry, that's the previous previous rulers foundation. It's a 14 week program that was for the first time implemented remotely to help persons be able to launch their business ideas out to the world. So if you're interested in you know having a business out you can look at this platform if you if you're not in a region that supports GoFundMe. Also, you can look for other CVs and other platforms available similar to this. Just informing you, those, those in the Middle East, that there are options out there for you as well. This has been Job Jobs. I hope you enjoyed the channel. Please hit that thumbs up, click and subscribe to the channel for more news updates. I am trying to do this more daily now. Thank you all for listening. See you next time.